everybody you welcome to this tutorial on symbolic link in Windows 7 or Windows environment so this is a very important tutorial and a lot of people who are Windows user don't know about this so this is the time that you need to break the habit so first thing I, I have a I'm the desktop right now I need to go to uh, show you what I'm want to do here so I have uh, uh, this folder on uh, C uh, WAM WW and I have other folder here on D so it D symphony my folder folder I need to mount uh, the folder here on D to this directory on C so how to do that using symbolic link so the first thing you need to do is going to the location that you want to mount that folder to so I need to go to the CMD here and uh, let me just type um, C C D. I I need to go to this location. Uh, C WAM WW. So just put C D WAM uh, C D C WAM. Okay, C D W W directory list of all the files here. I got all these files here, right? So now I need to um, make mounting to the folder in D. So I got this uh, folder here in D. I need to mount this folder to the folder in C. So, but before that, because I want to work with a server, I need to create a script here, a PHP script, in order to run it on the server. So let me just say index.php. Click yes, open it. Let me just try echo something. Echo. PHP first. Echo. Um, let me say header one. End of header one. Okay. Um, okay. Try to end it and end the PHP script. Here we want to type something like "hello," and don't forget to close the the quotation here. Okay. So this is pretty much the first thing I created this script on D, and it's in the uh, Symfony my, fo my folder folder. I need to create a link to this folder on the www folder on C. So you just copy the link here, move back to the folder that you want to mount to. So here we have this uh, parent directory. So I am in the WAMP, in the current directory, in C WAMP, WW. I need to mount that folder here. So I need to give it a name and I need to make a link to the folder D. In, on D directory, so just say mk make link, and I need to make a link for directory. So just slash D, and then you type the name. So let me say uh, my new website 2013. Okay, and I need to give the uh, the location for that link. So I just click paste here because I copied that link. But here it's on D. In the, in the directory, in the uh, disk, you know, local disk D. And here is Symfony, my folder. But stick with the notation for window, which is the backslash here. So here you just put make link D, my, the name for your uh, link or the folder, new folder. And then we put D, uh, Symfony, my folder, folder. After this, just click enter. So you say, you see here, you don't have sufficient privilege to do this because you need to run the CMD as administrator. So you just copy this command again and copy it. Close this and back to the command line, run it as administrator. Yes. Back to the track here. So let me move back to CD, C, WAMP, WW. Okay, I'm here right now. I need to make that link again using the privilege mode. So I just click enter. So let's say symbolic link created for my new website 2013. And this is the location, the mounted folder here. So basically, if you go to W file here, you got to see something like shortcut. But this is not a shortcut. This is a symbolic link. Okay. 
so double clicking here you're gonna remain in C directory you're not gonna move to D you are in C right and if you go to the server here if you run your browser and go localhost you're gonna see uh, the the folder here my new website so click here you gotta go and run the BHP script as as it is in the CWW folder so what was the difference between symbolic link and um, and the shortcut if you wanna make a shortcut like let me just say here come create a shortcut so I created a shortcut let me name it for example let's say uh, short short C okay so if you copy this cut this shortcut and go back to the C directory here in C WAMP try paste it okay try paste it here come back go to the browser go localhost so I'm a localhost right now so you can see here okay try refresh here we got the link we don't get, this is a symbolic link and this is a, a normal link a shortcut so if you click in the shortcut click on it so you know you see we gotta download the shortcut so you know treated this shortcut as a file not a, a, as a folder so this is the importance of symbolic link okay because you know sometimes assume that my folder is 20 gigabyte I don't want to move this whole folder to the server and try you know uh, work with it there just uh, created a mountain uh, a, a mountain uh, uh, mount, mount that folder you know just mount that folder into that in the directory that I want so this is pretty much awesome you know so this is a great feature in Microsoft Windows as it is in Unix so um, so you can use it all the time so I hope you enjoy this tutorial guys don't forget to subscribe the channel Ahmad Nasser with you all the time and uh, see you in another video thank you